स्टैंडर्ड टूल केमिस्ट्री यूनिट टूल हल्डीहाइड कीटोन एंड कार्बोक्सिलिक एसिड पार्ट फोर्टीन हियर वी डिस्कस अबाउट क्रॉस अल्डोल कंडेंसेशन क्रॉस अल्डोल कंडेंसेशन इज कैरिड आउट विथ केस नंबर वन हियर two different aldehyde for example ethanol and dipropenol or two different or dissimilar ketone for example propenol or butanol the second condition both should have alpha hydrogen on alpha carbon and third condition the reaction is carried out in presence of dilute alkali or here dilute sodium hydroxide here in case of suppose is ethanol or it is named as acetaldehyde or here CH3 CH2 CHO is propanol in case of ethanol with carbonyl group of the carbon this carbon is alpha carbon but here there are three alpha hydrogen while in case of propanol here with the carb carbonyl group of the aldehyde this carbon is alpha carbon but it has two alpha hydrogen this is the basic difference in between two different aldehyde same condition is here also here the reaction is carried out with ethanol and the propanol we get four different product because here suppose the reaction is carried out the mixture of ethanol and the second is propanol or propanol or butanol also so here it the reaction is between millions of ethanol molecule so here ethanol ethanol will react or propanol propanol will react because in a test in test tube there are millions of molecules present and this sec third condition ethanol and propanol will react and fourth condition is propanol or ethanol will react suppose here the reaction between two ethanol molecule dilute 
sodium hydroxide this will be alpha carbon 3 hydrogen 3 alpha hydrogen and this will be also alpha carbon and it has 3 alpha hydrogen CH3 CH this will be converted to OH and here CH2 and CH on heating OH and the one hydrogen is removed from here and the water molecule the product is from CH3 CH now this single bond will convert it to double bond CH CH one two three four on second position double bond is present there are four carbon chain and the aldehyde group but two in all this is the first product product one okay the first case suppose here propanol propanol will react is ethanol okay now propanol ch3 ch2 cho is propanol and the second molecule is also propanol dilute sodium hydroxide now the CH3 CH2 here CH and OH now this with this CH the methyl is attached with this carbon in CH CH3 and CH okay here OH and the hydrogen will be removed minus H2 and CH3 CH2 CH in this single bond will convert it to double bond and C CH3 CH numbering here 1 2 3 4 5 5 carbon chain on second position methyl group and the double bond is present the aldehyde will be principal functional groups okay, it is 2 methyl 5 carbon chain pent 2 in al and it is self aldol condensation product because here the condensation with the propanol and the propanol and the ethanol and the ethanol so it is called self aldol condensation this product is product number two why it is self aldol condensation because two similar aldehyde is present okay now the case two the condition says 
two different or two dissimilar aldehyde or ketone and the number two both should have alpha hydrogen on alpha carbon the second condition in presence of dilute sodium hydroxide the third suppose here two dissimilar aldehyde means what ethanol ch3 cho is ethanol and the propanol the reaction between ethanol and propanol here in case of ethanol is alpha carbon and it is 3 alpha hydrogen while in case of the propanol is will be our alpha carbon and it has only 2 alpha hydrogen okay in this similar aldehyde here CA3 C which need here CH OH and now with CH here the CH3 and CHO from OH and hydrogen is will be water molecule here dilute sodium hydroxide CA3 CH this single bond will be converted to double bond C CA3 and CHO okay now its name will be one two three four four carbon chain on second position methyl group and the double bond is present its name will be 2 methyl but 2 enol its product number 3 and the fourth reaction between propanol and ethanol here ca3 ch2 cho this propanol and the ethanol dilute sodium hydroxide CH3 CH2 here CH this will be converted to OH and the rest of the product here CH2 CHO OH and the one hydrogen here heating the water molecule is removed CH3 CH2 CH this single bond is converted to double bond CH CHO 1 2 3 4 and 5 and second position 
double bond is present five carbon chain and the aldehyde its name will be pent two in al the product number four here in case of ethanol and dipropanol will react the product is formed to methyl but to enol and the propanol or ethanol will react the product is formed pent to a enol this is called cross aldol condensation here cross aldol condensation here the case 3 number 1 two different or dissimilar aldehyde or ketone and the second condition is very most important alpha hydrogen in one of the two and not in another or other for example here is benzaldehyde with the car carbonyl group this will be our alpha carbon but it has no alpha hydrogen it has no alpha hydrogen while in case of the acetophenone suppose here CH3 CO CH3 is alpha carbon it has three alpha hydrogen here in case of this benzaldehyde this carbon has no alpha hydrogen and here in case of acetophenone this carbonyl group of the carbon this carbon is alpha carbon and it has three alpha hydrogen now the reaction in dilute sodium hydroxide here the benzene ring CH and wedge the can condensation here CH2 and CO and the benzene ring on heating or higher temperature OH the one hydrogen will remove as water molecule CH the single bond will be converted to double bond in the highs CH and here CO now its name here two phenyl ring is attached this will be our continuous chain one two three carbon one two and three carbon on first and uh, third position two phenyl ring it is named as one three 
diphenyl on second position double bond is present and th three carbon chain its name will be prop two in one on or its name will be benzal acetophenone and the second example for case 3 here this benzaldehyde and the second aldehyde is acetaldehyde or ethanol and it's two different aldehyde dilute sodium hydroxide solution here CH OH and it will be CH2 CHO with the carbonyl group this will be our alpha carbon and this will be our beta carbon on heating OH and the one hydrogen removed as water molecule here CH the single bond will convert it to double bond and CH CH and its name will be C name Aldi hide okay this very most important for the examination aspects now let's see about the another example suppose here is benzaldehyde or here CH HCHO it is methanol or formaldehyde here in case of the benzaldehyde and the methanol here it has alpha carbon but no alpha hydrogen here the carbon in case of the methanol there is no carbon so further reaction is not possible okay not possible for aldol condensation because there is no alpha hydrogen and the case number 4 the aldehyde which has no alpha hydrogen of aldehyde has no alpha hydrogen uh, for example here is 
HCHO or it is named as methanol or formaldehyde and the second molecule is also formaldehyde HCHO the concentrated sodium hydroxide solution and this will be converted to methanol and the another product here So here are the concentrated potassium hydroxide is used is C double O K or potassium format or sodium format is formed. Here we used potassium hydroxide, so potassium format is formed. And this reaction is called Canizaro reaction. Is the second example. It's benzaldehyde. the another molecule of benzaldehyde both has no alpha hydrogen alpha carbon is present but no alpha hydrogen A concentrated potassium hydroxide it is converted to here CA3 or CH2OH CH2OH and the rest of the part will be converted to potassium salt there oh. it is named as benzyl alcohol or suppose here the concentrated sodium hydroxide is used the product will be formed yes. here C double O N A it is named as sodium benzoate Uh, this is the concept about the Canizaro reaction. Now the uses of aldehyde and ketone, they are used as solvent or formally is used as preservative or to prepare bakelite or it is used in perfumery industries. Okay friends. So next time we will discuss another topic. Thank you very much.